Hello everyone, my name is Sutton the Wolf, and welcome back to Fear Pea Shooting Dangerous. I am on stage three now. I'm in I'm going towards the town circus, I guess. Oh gosh, are those bombs? Those are bombs. I like the soundtrack though, it's quite it's like I don't want to say festive, that's not the right term for it. It's quite bubbly and cheerful. Whoa, what the hell? Eek. Oh, it's kind of throwing me off that C doesn't do anything. Because it's Z to shoot, X to... for B is the is the equivalent of, like, declining or saying for A B. Um, and then V on the keyboard is to change my formation rather than X. Or, not, I mean, not X, uh, rather than C. So it kind of throws me off. But it's not terrible. Oop. E, e, d, d, d. Okay, so the... the so it looks like with every stage, there will be things that shoot other things. And I have to take out the things that shoot the other things so that the other things will actually be depleted. So I want to shoot behind me now. And then this will take out all those, right? So if I take out all the circus thing, all of its little particles that it's shooting will be eliminated. All right. Yep. All right. I'm starting to get it. Woo. Yeek. Hyper mode. Come on, take it. There we go. All right, I'm starting to get the hang of this, guys. I know I'm gonna say that and then immediately die, but it seems like I'm actually, you know, getting into it here. So, eesh. what are these little, like, jester hats on balls? Like, what the hell? Some circus. Warning. Hello? Oh, hi. Are you Master and Crazy Hand from Super Smash Brothers? No. Uh, oh god, oh god, what the f- Okay, uh, I'm gonna use my super formation here. I have no idea what is going on here. Oh gosh, I don't want to get hit by that. Just die already. Die, 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 die. Oh, I got hit, damn it. Barely. Alright, well, I have zero life left. Alright, so that's like a little mid boss, I guess. I wonder who the boss of this one's gonna be. The only other QP shooting characters I'm aware of... Let's see, so there's Yuki. There's... Um... I'm pretty sure Aru is from QP shooting. Um... I'm pretty sure... Let's see... Um... Oh, damn it. I died. Wow, I didn't even die at the boss, that was hard. But, uh... Krilla is also at from this game. So she makes her first appearance here. All right, um, let's see. Yep, okay. Other than them, who else do I know of? Other than Kyosuke, obviously. Who else is from QP Shooting that I know of? Um, let's see. Well, let's go through who's not. So Mark, Pete, and Mark, Pete, and some of, like, all the Fernet and all the flying ship characters are from, um, and the Seagull are from, uh, Flying Red Barrel, which is Mark's game. Um, which all of these are bullet hells, if I remember correctly. Um, Sugiri is obviously from Sugiri, uh, along with Hime and, uh, some others. <laughs> I don't really know these games entirely too well. But, okay, I'm gonna hyper here. I hit the wrong button there. But, ah! Oh gosh. Oh god, wait. I, oh, I got a life again. Okay, I didn't realize I was out of lives. That was dangerous. All right, go behind. Rawr. Okay. I like the sprite work of this game. It's quite nice. Oop. I was, I was saying before in my 200% mixed juice, playthrough. I wasn't a big fan of the way that they portray QP, but in this game I quite like it. Ah, oh, I lost the light. Gotta watch that splash damage. Okay, so there's still... I gotta learn to pay attention to certain things that are moving. Like, I need to not pay attention so much as to the slow-moving things. Damn it. I need to pay attention not so much to the slow-moving things as much as the fast-moving things, because those are the things that are difficult to avoid. Eh. Warning. Okay, so now it's the big man, right? 
Oh man, I'm out of I'm out of health already. This isn't good. All right, well, let's fire like this. Oh my god. Oh yeah, that's difficult. All right. Hmm. I didn't even get as far as I did last time. Alrighty. All right, let's go. Start again. Jeez. This might be a little bit bigger test of my abilities here, man. Men and women. Ladies and germs. Ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen and gentlewomen and everything in between. All who have come to enjoy the delightful fragrance of QP shooting. Dangerous. Oh boy, am I? I'm getting a little bit of FPS issues here, guys. Eek! 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 I hope my computer doesn't, like, totally break down from all of this. Because I've been having computer issues, guys. It looks like there's a lot going on here. I've got a fan underneath my computer. Oh, God. Oh, jeez, this is rough. Oh, God. Yup. That's a problem. <laughs> I'm gonna pause for a second there. Oh, we good? We good? I think we're good. Alright, I think we're good. Eek! Okay. I think we're good. Ooh, still a little bit iffy. But it's a lot better than it was. Alright. So yeah, it looks like I'm only going to be able to play a few episodes of this at once, guys. Because my computer does not like all of these big graphical things it's doing right now. I think that's what it is. Yeah, I got a life. Let's try not to lose it. Okay, so now we get the behind thingies. And explosions. Not gonna get hit by the obvious yellow particles that blended so perfectly with the road. Ugh. Okay. Yep. Alright. Let's get rid of this thingy so I can get rid of all those. Alright. Start blowing these up. Alright, get over here. There we go. Oh, I lost- Oh, how did I lose my life? Grr. Man. Eek. Alright, this is very difficult. So, I somehow need to try and get past this guy without losing any health. So let's go for this formation at the moment. Oh god. Okay. So far, so good. Yeek. Okay. Good at the moment. Oop. Come on, 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 Got him! Awesome. Coolio. Wow, 1,227 chain. I'm imagining that's good. I think. I mean, it's not like I've ever taken my finger off the shoot button. Okay. I gotta get rid of that thing. Hyper. Jeez. All these explosions are difficult. That's a Ferris wheel. What the heck? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's a lot of things! Hyper. Oh god. Uh, uh. Eh. Oh, I finally understand QP's Hyper in 100% Orange Juice now. It ups her damage and it prevents her from dying. <laughs> if, she go if she goes down. That makes a lot of sense. Oh, I ran into one. God damn it. Alright, I'll give it one more try. No, oh, maybe two. I've been not doing so hot in this one. I got farther than I did in the other tries. Alright, so let's do this. Alright, come on. I got this. It's very nice, like... It's very nice how I'm starting to learn a bit more about the motivations for things in the games that I know. Like, the, con the conglomeration games. But... I'm still, like, still, I'm still kind of... Damn it, I got kind of trapped there. I need to not get trapped in corners. But it's very nice to learn what things mean from other games. But I also kind of want to know more about this one. And so, I'm really curious to see, like, what's going on, like, what the story is as it unfolds. Because... Because avoiding vast amounts of bullets and shooting even more bullets is wonderful. But I would actually like to know what is going on, as for like what kind, some kind of story. And I don't know if this is standard for bullet hells, 
having, as I've said multiple times, never played one before. Um, I don't know if it's standard that the story just kind of unfolds um, as you go, like like it has so far, like just throughout the stages, like the without actually exiting the stage itself. Um, but it's just a new experience for me. If that's the case, then I guess I'll get used to it. Okay, I got. I don't know why I actually don't start out with any life here, any bonus life. Yeah. Okay, change formation. Hyper mode. Take that thing down. Let's stop all of these stupid things. Yeah. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you too. Get rid of you, and then get rid of you. Yes. You see, I have developed very good powers. All right. So now I've got Mr. Hattie McMustache here. All right. So this is a lot of dodging that needs to happen really well. Okay. So I'm gonna stay over here. Um, oh, okay, that wasn't so bad. Okay, avoid you. That's a lot of things. Okay, hyper's ready, so if I get into a pinch, I can do this. Uh, change formation to the... Real, oh, god damn it! I got hit again. Alright, let's hyper. Gotcha. Cool. Alrighty, so I don't have a life anymore. I need to try and get through that without with a life left. But, uh -huh. alas, it is to no avail. So, I don't know how I actually get lives back. Is it just a certain point total that I get to? Oh my gosh. Uh, 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 uh. So, I'm getting a better idea of what my hitbox is. My hitbox appears to be, like, just QP's torso. Her head doesn't seem to be a, an issue. Um, but if I can avoid hitting her torso, then we're good. It... Okay. Whoa, explosions. Makes things difficult. Okay, I've got multiple enemies firing things at me here. I need to get rid of one of them. Uh, I really need a hyper. I could use a hyper. Thank you. Okay, I need to get rid of one of these things. Thank you. Thank you. Get rid of you. All right, we're good. I need to get rid of things fast. There's a Ferris wheel here. It's kind of ganking my steez here. Hyper mode. Oh god, did I do it? Okay, we got that. Get rid of some of these Ferris wheel carts. Oh god, that's a lot of projectiles. Oh, gosh, barely. Oh god, oh god, oh god, hyper. Hyper mode, hyper mode, hyper mode, hyper mode, hyper mode, hyper mode, hyper mode. Oh god, I got it. Awesome. Alright, are we at the boss now? Please tell me we're at the boss. Nope, we're not. <laughs> oh my god, how am I even gonna beat the boss? Holy cow. I've only really gotten once this time, I think, I, th I think, though. Eek. Oh my gosh. Alright. I'm gonna try and save my hyper. Whoa, hello. Whoa. Hi. What are we doing now? It is Curla! This must be the place that guy was talking about. Oh, so you've come. Who's there? Pudding. So you know of Pudding? The seductive fruit bathed in deep darkness. Its existence brings happiness to people, but confusion to the world. I'm not really sure what you're saying, but it does seem like you know pudding. I wonder, perhaps you could say I do. It is not transcribed in the mind of this Pilalaris, only in that of the great god of darkness I worship. I need a translation. Someone, please translate! <laughs> I don't actually know pudding, but my boss does! Who's there now? Be that as it may. Right now, could you take me to this boss of yours? We'll have a duel. If you win, I'll show you the way. Otherwise, you could always treat me to a rice dinner. I haven't had a single grain in over three days. Win and be shown the way, or just treat us to rice. I don't need a translation for that one. Oh, I'd prefer to handle things peacefully as possible, but you see, I don't have any money. <laughs> okay, so I can't treat you to pudding. Oh, I love that face from Kipi, that's cute. I bought a sweet roll of my last 100 yen just a while ago. Okay, so we are in Japan. That will do just fine. Fermented wheat filled with red bean paste. I already ate it. Uh, death to you. Just like that, no questions asked. Okay, so I'm fighting Krilla now. All right. Okay, so I can kind of get the circus theme. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, okay. 
I need to, I might want to change formations here. Yep, I'm changing formations. Alright, I need to get the area of effect going for this one. Now I need to go behind me. Get you. Okay. Get back to this. Okay, I need to utilize shooting behind me for this one. Alright, come on. Almost got her. Ah! Fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Ugh! Damn it! That was so hard to get to! Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it! Damn it. All right, come on. I could do this. I don't care if this is a new genre of games to me. I will defeat this. Damn it. All right, I'm gonna beat this stage. I will beat the stage this episode, regardless of how many times I've cut this damn video. If I fail another time, I'll start cutting the video to where I like actually, to where I actually get back to where I was before I died. But at the moment, I will succeed. I will succeed without having to cut this. I know I will. I will guarantee it. By the gods of pudding and friendship and kawaii. <laughs> wow, that was bad. <laughs> I need to get back on my Japanese lessons. <laughs> that just reminded me of that. Ugh. Yeah. You know, I actually... Move. You know, I like I, I say that I've been learning Japanese a lot, um, and it's true that I've been taking lessons, but to learn a language, it is a lot of work. Like, it's not just as simple as, oh, hey, take a Presetta Stone and then bam, you're done. Like, there are so many things that you don't actually get from program- oh, whoa, I already died? Holy frick. Oh, I forgot I don't start with the bonus lives like I should. And the other ones, Jesus. All right, but what I was trying to say was like, languages are really interesting in that they have so many regional dialects and slang words and other things like that. And so when you say learning a language, you're not necessarily learning the entire language. You're learning the basic form of the language. You're not learning like slang terms all the time. You're not learning like all of the regional dialects. It's like, it's like if someone were to learn English, and then, like, if, if a non-native English speaker were to go and learn English, quote, quote, unquote, then come to America, then it would be very different in, like, say, the north of, northern half of America versus the southern half. Like, people wouldn't necessarily know what y'all is, or like, people wouldn't necessarily know other slang like that. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I got a heart. I'm gonna try to keep this heart now. But, that's one of the things that I want to actually be able to figure out. Like, I don't want to just learn a language, I want to understand the language. I want to know slang terms, I want to know regional dialects, and how I can... And like, I want to be able to go to one part of a country and be able to speak to people and then be able to speak just as well with people in another part of the country. And that's really what I'm trying to strive for in these studies that I'm doing. Um, and it's not just in college that I'm studying these things, it's that it's in like just outside of class, like with these lessons I've been taking. Um, granted, I have been kind of slacking on them because I've, been, I've just gotten done with the semester and summer started and so I've been a bit I've been trying to readjust a bit, but it's been fun. Like, there, there isn't much that I find more fun than, god damn it, than, certainly this is more fun than dying like that, but I find it very fun to understand people. Because one thing that I really don't like about tourists, like, predominantly English-speaking tourists are like this, but that's not to say that other tourists aren't like it as well. A lot of people like to go to another country and just assume that they speak the same language as they do. Or like, just assume that they know English, for example. Um, and that can be offensive to people. Like, it can be very offensive if you go up to say like, a German person, and then you just start talking in, in English like you expect it to be their first language. Like, it's such a nonchalant thing that you don't really think about as a tourist, but that really does like, that really does get into the head of some people. And that just kind of sets a bad image. And so I want to be able to 
go up to someone and not maybe not necessarily be perfect. I'd love to be perfect in the language, but like I understand that's like a long ways away. But if I can just go up and try my best and at least get them to understand me in their own language, then I feel like that's going to go a long way in, you know, crossing the regional barrier, the international barrier that that is of languages that normally people don't get to cross. And so that's just kind of what I'm trying to strive for in my life. So, be it as it may, uh, I hope I can learn to talk better. Me, Kyle, want to talk good. Er, whoa, jeez. Kyle Sutton, whatever I may be called. It just, okay. Getting back into the game here. Sorry about that, guys. Going on a little tangent, tangent. Oh god, oh god, oh god. It. Got it. Sweet. So I'm going to the boss now, yeah? Or no, this is the part where I, I'm almost there. I didn't save my life, though, which sucks. Whoa, I almost got hit by one there. What? Jeez. There's so many little things that can hit you. Alright, well, I should be fine. Yep, I'm fine. Cool, we're good. Alright, so now I'm gonna fight Krilla. Ah, my hand. Alright, Krilla, get over here. How are we flying? <laughs> That's one thing I want to know. Alright, come on. Skip the cutscene. Let's go. <laughs> QP. You look cute. Alright, we're doing this now. Whoa, are you trying to trap me or something? Oof. Okay, so I still shoot a little bit forward. Whoa! Cage. I want to try and save this hyper for when I'm in a pinch. When I'm in a pinch. I'm in a pinch. Not in a pinch yet. Not quite in a pinch yet. Looks like a- oh, jeez, these cages are a bit annoying. Yes, I got a life! Sweet. Alright, I want to try and keep this life. Eh. I finally got a life! I've done what everyone in school has always told me to do! I finally got a life! Okay, kinda need to use that there. Eh, get this out of here. Fuck, I got hit. Didn't lose my life, though. Alright, get out of here, Krilla. Gotcha. Alright, that's the first stage. All right, now let's get out of here. So there's three stages, right? First one changes the actions that she takes. Fuck. First one, she changes how she attacks. Second one, I get a cutscene. Third. Third one is the final form or whatever. God damn it. Ugh. All right. I might have to. I might have to cut the video. All right. Well. <laughs> all right. Well, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Jeez. All right, we're back at the boss fight. Grr! I feel like I have gotten much better since my last encounter with you, Krilla. Krilla Laris of the Dark Fragrance. Rar. Oh, okay. Well, I was able to save myself with the hyper. Shit! Well, I'm just gonna... Uh, yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Alright, we're good. Okay. Alright. I made it to the boss fight with my life left. Alright. This should be my... This is my best shot I've had yet. Oh, boy. And if I play this right, I should get another one during the fight, so... Alrighty. Alright, let's go. Alright. Krila. Yep, there's the life. Let's take that out. These are imperative to take out, these cages. They are very dangerous. Eek. No screws, come on. All right, come on. Come on. Cool. All right, gotten decent at this. I've been doing this for about an hour, guys. Whoa. Sheesh. All right, come on, you. Get some hyper action in there. Okay, I can fight her again. This is the farthest I've gotten. Whoa, 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 hello. Jesus, 
What's firing at me? Jesus. Alright, gotta keep moving then. Alright, that's fine. Shit! I, hit it. I lost another one. Got more rabbits. Gotcha. Should be a cutscene now. Final attack. Oh god, it's... Dance long, you beasts! Oh god. He's hyper! Okay. Thank you. What? 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 What hit me? Ah, bollocks! Ah, I'll be right back. The tenaciousness of my persistence is imminent! Not imminent, that's not the correct word for it. <clears throat> Nice. Okay, I'm back again. Alright. <clears throat> ah. Back, I'm back. Okay. Whew. Man. The difficulty spike, it must be said. The difficulty spike is kinda immense here. This, uh, this third level is much, much harder than the other two. Alright, we got this. Oh, the chain hits me too? Fuck. I didn't know that. Get her. Get her, get her, get her. Get her, get her. Damn it. Almost got her. Oh, my orbits are all gone. Shoot. My orbits went away. Ah, my orbits got hit. Shit. I didn't realize my orbits could get taken out on that, like, to that extent. Jeez. Alright, well, I'll be back again. The timer is getting much higher. <laughs> uh, it's a good thing I'm recording just out of leisure today. I didn't actually, I'm not desperate for any recording sessions right now, otherwise I would have probably run out of time. <laughs> but I'm just doing this for funsies today because I got nothing else to do, so. I got a lot more time on my hands, but that doesn't mean I want to spend it all on this one singular level. But, oh well. That's what I'm getting. I'm getting my money's worth out of this game, damn it. This is my first experience with shoot 'em up bullet held things, so I might as well get good. Because I'm a scrub. Jeez, the frickin'... Jeez, the frickin' knives. So here's the deal. It's been two hours. I figured out how to beat that boss, but I'm having issues. So, uh, I'm gonna leave this episode here, and then we're gonna continue sometime else, because I've got other recording I want to do. So, 
With that, unfortunately, I'm not going to beat stage three yet. But I probably will come back to this because it is pretty fun. So with that, thank you all so very much for watching. This has been a session of QP Shooting Dangerous. I don't know if my next session will be two days. Start will like it, the videos will come out at a time that's appropriate for you guys, like for two days after this, or if it's gonna be a little bit down the road. But I'm probably gonna come back to this, and I'm gonna beat Krilla because damn, that was annoying. But regardless, thank you so much for watching. As always. Leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. I can't even talk, I've been focusing so hard. I will always read your comments and I will always take them into account. And as always, I will see you guys next time on QP Shooting Dangerous. <laughs>